Hi friends, this topic is about honesty and how it's going to help you to improve your health. I can remember a conversation that I had with a lady and she was in the gym working on her own transformation and I had, I've had my own transformation of my own. I don't really put it out there but um, here's a picture for you to look at of where I was at. So this picture was quite a few years ago, over 10 years ago, and I was in college um, drinking lots of beer. I had a lot of good friends, eating a lot of pizza. Just I didn't really have any notion of a diet or nutrition or nourishment or health at all. It was really more about fun, you know, anything that you that you go through, maybe in your early 20s, late teens. That was, you know, that, that period of my life. And so it was real difficult to transi transition out of it. And I was also very naive. And the lady that I had talked to, she said, how did you do it? How did you make your transformation? And it struck me. And I thought back, and, that, and, and what came to me was honesty. I came to a point that I realized that I have to be honest with myself. And when I started to become honest with myself, I could be honest with others. And not just honest, like, um, about them. I don't, not, I'm not talking about, like, when you talk to somebody and you're honest with you what, about them, what you think about them, but you're honest about yourself with that person. And what that gets us is realization. So um, when we're honest to another person about who we are, about who we think we are, and, and how we are, it gives that person a realization of, of how to think about you. So like if you're going around with the status quo of what everybody else is saying, um, and not truly being honest about yourself, then everybody thinks the same way. It, if you can catch how that works. So, like, if I'm talking to you and, and we pass, and, and I say, hey, how you doing? And you're like, oh, yeah, I'm good, I'm good. And then there's just a real quick pass. Nothing, you get the same thought process, but, like, if you actually stop and, and, and give your time and say, hey, how are you doing? And then have an actual conversation. That honesty creates self-realization uh, for that person and for yourself as well. So a part of um, a great transformation is honesty. And what honesty gets you is self-realization. You're not lying to yourself. You're, you're not hiding anything, and you can be as open as possible. I think that's the key and secret to anybody's success or fulfillment is, is that, that key element is, hey, um, if something's not working for you, you got to be honest about it instead of trying to make something that doesn't fit right. When you're honest about it, it's like, hey, th I'm doing all the right things, I'm trying all the right things, but it's still not working for me. Um, just, just be honest with yourself and over and over again, just always review that, you know. Is this what's making me happy? Yes or no? I mean, it's a really easy question, and, and most of the times when we ask ourselves that question, we'll say, is this really making me happy? No, but, and then we start to neg negotiate. It is giving me these cool things. It's not. It's just, you can't argue for it if it's not working for you. So, be honest with yourself. Um, and uh, it works. It just provides clarity. It provides um realization so that long-term thought that long-term goal that we have of you know clarity or freedom isn't so long term it's actually a moment thing like a moment of clarity and those moments of clarity build up and build up and build up and all of a sudden when you're working with this honesty aspect of who you are you start to feel better about yourself and once you start to feel better you start to look better you start to see yourself looking better and that's an uplifting thing